Lot of cars to destroy. Quickly run through and get rid of them all. Should be enough. And obviously, doing specials on these guys give you a few more souls and a little bit more of a rage recharge, too. We want that car. Let's try and lure these away from it so I don't hit it accidentally. Try and get a few more souls off these guys as and where possible. Okay, now what you want to do is pick up the car and this area above. As you can tell by the weird glowy stuff, is actually a bomb. So we want to chuck the car up there. Which does this. And if I close that off, allows us to go up and pick up our first piece of abyssal armor. Wonderful, isn't it? So yeah, after 10 you get your nice, and it is very nice, armor. So we shall be keeping an eye out for those. For now, just in case of clearing up really, before we move on to the um, prison. Grab us some more souls. Most of the mobs in these areas respawn whenever you leave and return. So it's always fairly easy to pick up um, some extra souls if you're a bit short. imprisoned here. There are things even you should fear, horseman. Once you were strong, but now you are weak and you are alone. The destroyer knows of your coming. Even now, he moves his legions against you. Then I'll make this quick. See? There's always somebody screaming in my face. You forgot one thing, oh little red man. We are war. And we have a horn. No, you won't. I will take your little soldier souls, though. Seems like a good trade to me. Come on, this way. I don't want you near your master. Oh, in the back, yeah, sneaky bastard. One for the take in. And two. I wish you'd stop saying that. You're not going to take anything. 
I'm going to take more than your head, mate. Twat. I'll move back and set it to the side. His reach is bloody annoying. There we go. Even though that was close. That's at war. Show him. Come on. With his own bloody axe. Yeah. Take my head now, big man. Today is not a good day to die. Unless you're you. Not if you're war. Right, obvious puzzle is obvious. One gargoyle spitting up blood, the other two aren't, so you know what to do. Just one hideous blood puking gargoyle. <laughs> oh, monster in the pit. Scary stuff. And there we go. They never show you where all this blood comes from. War. Are you here to play executioner? They should have set all four of you. I have no interest in killing you, Samael. Ah, the destroyer. Is beyond your reach, beyond mine. Has prison made you a coward? See, again with the being screamed at. Perhaps there is a way, but you will need to get inside the destroyer's spire. The tower is guarded by four of his chosen. Bring me their hearts and ask me no questions. My reasons for helping you are my own. Where can I find He said ask him no questions, are you deaf? The Twilight Cathedral. <sighs> Queen Tiamat has gone to roost. The whole of her domain is a blistered inferno. My land, you will never reach it. Find the high ground with this. And bring me still beating heart. I like the way they made his wings upside down. Gives him a nice look. Okay, so now we have a new ability. Hold down the button when you jump and you get a bit of a hover with the wings. That is the way we want to go, but we're not going to go that way just yet. If you just make your way around. Head for that building up at the end. Let's clear up some of these while I'm at it. Right, so yeah, head for the building up at the end. Hello. Goodbye. They're these little icons. You'll see them all over the place. You'll hear them, more importantly. And whenever you hear them, it tends to be a Volgrim location nearby, which is great if you want to do some shopping.
or if you want to do some teleporting later on so it's worth opening them up as soon as you see them it does happen to be one here so there we go And we're going to trade in those artifacts as well, just so it gets over the one grand. And I want Weapon Master. A little bit of extra damage on the weapon. Always good. So, let me just equip that. Okay. So now my sword is slightly better, as you can see with the effects on it. And while we're here, there is also another abyssal piece, as you can see by the path just over there. I'll move the cursor over it. I'm not going to be able to get there just yet, but um, at some point we will. And the next, well not next, one of the abyssal pieces anyway, is over there. So, not much left to do. Apart from carry on with our journey. Kill a few crows if they'll let us. I've no idea why crows give you so much health. Are you trying to belly fart me, aren't you? Yeah, go on. Yeah, just get out of it, you big fat git. Oh, don't fall off the edge ward, please. Leave me what little credibility I have. Have you really died in the like intro section? Oh well. So yeah, carry on. Pretty much. Make our way through various hell holes on the way. What's that noise? Something following us. Uh And another wing section. Those um, blue spheres, of course, help you move upwards whenever you've got your wings out. Make our way up again. Uh, these things just hit them and move past pretty fast. Easy enough. That big weird glowy orange thing on the wall we can't use till later on so just ignore it for now basically where we want to go is over there so hopefully it won't be too hard now for a little bit of fun and over we go easy enough Through that horrible pit. Am I into an even worse place? This whole section is absolutely massive. And these bats are friggin' annoying. 
best way to deal with them. If you want to get rid of them quickly, it's just jump and press B. And you just do that nice little move like I've done. Little word with Volgrim. Get another location while we're here. Do we have enough for anything? What do I want? Please take your time. A dash move in the air. I think I want that one actually. I have a feeling it may come in handy. Picking up a couple of artifacts. Yeah, I know, I know. Yep. Right. There are absolutely shed loads of enemies here. Most of these annoying bastards. You gonna get up? And yes, they are all over the place. Absolutely masters of them. Don't block me when I'm hitting you. And we've alerted fat, so wonderful. That move I picked up allowing you to do that. It's kind of cool. Handy for reaching. E no. Handy for reaching um, stuff that's a little bit out of range whenever you're trying to jump. Do with some health actually. Hello. Why? I like dispatching things. Take that, you horrible creature. And some health from it as well. Always good. No, this area has a lot of stuff in it. A lot. This being one of them. Can't quite remember if there's actually anything. Oh, well, there is. Okay. Obviously the artifact, so we'll have that while we're here. Nothing else, unfortunately. 
think they'd be a little bit more under a grave. I'm not sure if the other ones might, but I don't think so. I think they're broken. Again, carrying on just to destroy stuff basically. I know it's boring as hell, but it kinda has to be done. That was one shiny chest. Get the bigger guys over here. Just make a way around killing them all, really. Smack. Just about to launch into a big combo there. Good job that I saw that pop up. Can't remember whether there's anything down there or not. For now we'll say no and leave it just in case. Don't want to die again this early. Right, so we're done with this side of the map. A few more of these little buggers. Cutting through them like a hot knife through bother. Still fairly early on. Did I hear a squeaker? I did. I love you, thank you. I really don't like those guys. The trouble with them really is they're just so hard to damn hit. One less skeleton in the world. I tend to like to go around these areas to start with. Purely because it's easier to do at the start. Once you've done the ones, you don't really have to do it again. Not sure why those pop up actually, in all fairness. Must be for destroying everything on the map or something. Good enough reason to me. Nip over and pick it up. Oh, nice. Another lifestone shard, fair enough. The first time I played this game was on my old PC, so all the kind of effects around his sword and things, I didn't really get all that well. Oh no. I don't know why these guys gave me trouble. Might actually just have been the fact that I was playing with the keyboard. Definitely feels a lot more fluid with the um, Xbox controller. Right, how many thingies have we got? Souls. Right, so we get two of those. Yeah, maybe buy something else. Hello, greedy one. I 
thousand. Oh, very nice. Right, what do we want? These are all the kind of consumables. We'll not bother with those. Whirlwind combo's kind of nice. 891. Oh, I want that. Harpin Tackle, of course. That. Which also transforms your in air one. What way am I going? Yeah, this way, okay. I saw you, you great big lump. Hit me, will you? Yeah, that wasn't entirely fantastic that we did take out the bird, so that was kind of cool. <laughs> I love it when they help. Get rid of this freak. There we go. I did see another chest over here, didn't I? Yep, up at the end. Okay. Although it is a house one, so I'm not sure I really want to pick it up. Oh, it's one of those. Remember if you see any of those. You'll need to come back to them later on. And again, nothing down there, so this area is pretty much clear, we'll move on. Hello? Are you trying to be brave? A bit late for that, I'm afraid. Did he just summon all his mates? No, he didn't. Okay. So this is where we want to go. Of course another gate there, but there is also this area. Drop. Silly war. Another chest with some souls in it, which we'll gratefully receive. Kind of hoping this isn't the next area. No, it's just a bonus, okay.
And there we go. The final one of the collections. There's the Wrath Shards. Two little yellow blobs under my health bar. You can use Wrath Shards to get through on those. Uh, nothing really I can do about that at the minute, so off to come back. I like games that reward you for exploring. Go and wake up old sleepy. For the destroyer, my brother spoke of your coming, but a powerful curse holds me now. I cannot help you. Any curse can be broken. Yes, perhaps. These servants of the destroyer walk unseen within the realm of shadow. By their blood, we are bound. By their blood shall we be free. I can no longer move within the Shadow Realm. Much of my power has left me. You need not enter it. I will grant you the power to see into the accursed realm for a time. But to what end? What hope have we now against the Destroyer's foul? Sorcery. Hope will not bring you freedom. Yes. Again being yelled at. Find where these shadow lurkers hide and kill them all. They can't be that hard to find. 